What up, everyone? Crypto Marxist, a.k.a. Bone Army, coming at you. So I have a banger for you guys. I've been talking about this one for a couple of days. I will tell you guys that I was pretty active in the chat, and they actually put me in the admin uh, chat. All right, so I have a little alpha for you guys. I had told you about these corrupt NFTs, the corrupt the NFTs. They're limited to only 50, all right? They were launched, okay? There's only 50 of them. They're launched. The Mint is live. I'm going to show you the website. I'm going to link the website in the description. You already know I'm trying to get the Bone Army, uh, the Alpha, and get you guys in. There's only 50, and I think already 20 have been minted, all right? And there was even a little error that occurred, and I will tell you about it, all right? Because you guys know I'm going to keep it 100 with you. All right, so first of all, let's just check the chart. The chart of this thing has been crazy from the beginning. I told you guys that I might have found the banger because, as I was telling you guys, sometimes I'll go ahead, get all these little plays, and a lot of them rug. I'm going to be honest. They just they rug. So next thing I know, I, I go, oh, let me check the chart. And I'm like, what the hell? They took the liquidity out? Wow. I guess I'll just take that L. This one, though, uh, the name was risky, but I still put a you know couple bucks in it when it was small as how I'm talking about like maybe ten thousand market cap. I think I put like probably like ten bucks in it. So and but then I forgot about it. And then bad idea started having that mad uh, March Madness Sarah simulation game with different projects from like FEF, uh, Shiba Dreams, Bad Idea AI, um, Walk Token corrupt fund was one of them so i was like wait corrupt fund is being mentioned in this because keep in mind a lot of the shibarian projects honestly they just tank they, they they're not really too active all right and but some of them are high quality like c fund like skulls like dam like pika all right so there's a lot of bangers out there this one like i told you felt like a banger i think we might have a home run with this one all right not financial advice. I repeat, not financial advice. But me, myself, definitely shored up a bag on this one. All right, guys? So I'm just telling you, not financial advice. Look at it. Do your own research. But look at the chart. From the beginning, very explosive chart. Just very explosive chart. Even when it goes down, it never fully just tanks. It goes down and just explosive. Like people want to buy the dips. In other words, it's very alpha. What do I tell you guys all the time? Alpha gets bought. I repeat, alpha gets bought. And this, you can already see, even from the recent sell, look, boom, boom. And actually, this person missed out already. These sales, boom, the price left them. Then it spiked up. Look at this sell. And this sell spiked, left them. And what's going to happen with this one? If this one dares to do that, it's most likely going to get left. Because you can see, this is first right here. First right here, boop, broke out. Now you have this upward trajectory, broke every single resistance. Resistance. This one right here also, it, it actually met this resistance, met up against it a couple of times. This bottom support, which it was basically riding, went ahead and came to a pressure point right here. And what? Boom. Yes, exploded. Look at this. Someone said my chart was broken. I left it at that, but actually the person didn't, didn't realize that actually the chart actually predicted this breakout. The, the chart didn't get broken. The chart predicted this breakout. So, but anyways, we'll leave it at that. Um, so this is at $56,000 market cap. I told You can go back, check some of my lives. You can see I told you about this project when it was about $17,000. So just from that, you're talking about a 3x basically all right so just putting it out there not financial advice they did burn some of the liquidity i have been in communication with the team and part of the reason why i'm bullish on this project is they have a logo they have a website a lot of these rugs don't so yes extremely bullish on it let me go ahead and show you so i already went ahead showed you boom chart looking sexy liquidity right there looking sexy as well seven day 116 percent 24 hours keep in mind everything is tanking look skulls for pika down 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 wolf down this br bnr might be the next rug who knows but see that's how they look they pop up and they look kind of ruggy from so like, hey let's see what this is that might be small put five bucks in it anyways this down 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 everything red 
except this one up 25%. And actually, it says 40%. I think it was up higher earlier. But either way, with that said, let's go ahead and I'll just get into what the point of this video is. My bad. Don't mean to be long-winded, but the point of this video, actually, let's go back. It's the Mint, but this is the website. This is the website. So this is CorruptFun.com. So I'm going to link this one, CorruptFun.com, so you can check out the website. And here it is. 51 of 1 Corrupt These NFTs will be live Sunday, April 14th. Today is Sunday and they are live. I believe they actually were released yesterday. So just throwing that out there, I believe they were released yesterday and there was something that happened with the contract because they wanted only one wallet per NFT. There's only 50 regardless. No matter what, there's only 50. But they wanted it to go per wallet and there was a, a bull feature that wasn't input, which actually allowed people to mint more than one from the Shibarium scan. Anyways, long story short, it's out. 50, one of one corrupties. You hit this right here, and it takes you, hopefully, let's see. Does it, yep, it does. It takes you to the Mint site. The Mint site is mint.corrupt.fun. But like I said, go. I'm going to link both of them so you can check it. But come over here, connect your wallet ASAP. They cost about 100 they cost a hundred bone, but one thing I forgot to tell you guys, my bad. Let's go back to the chart. Let's go back to the chart real quick. Let's go back to the sexy ass, juicy looking chart right here. You need one million corrupt fund token in order to be able to mint the NFT. Okay, so you need one million. So that's the requisite. One million corrupt fund, okay, C fund tokens. In order to be able to come over here to this website right here and buy for 100 bone one of these corrupties. And I'm going to show you what they look like also. Let's see also how many have been minted. Let me go ahead and refresh this. All right. So it's already it's 8.30 a.m. when I'm recording this. It might go up like by 9. So there's 20, there's 20 holders. There's 20 holders and 27 have been minted. So 27 have been minted. One person minted five. So they're at, they actually, this wallet right here, this wallet right here. So basically there's a contingency plan because this person is like, oh, let me go ahead and mint this and get all these rewards. No, sir. There's a contingency plan. It's one per wallet. And they already spoke about compensating that whale. You know what I mean? Because they did put their money in. But this, even though this is a corrupt fund, they're trying to run this as legitimate as possible. Yesterday, they did a big-ass burn. So that's probably why the price is going crazy as well. But with that said, let's go ahead and check them out. Look at this. Some dope ones. Man, Spider-Man, CVO. This one says Ho. This one says CRO. This one says Panda. This is Hulk. This is Kuo. This one right here says Wukong. This one says Cat, Corrupt Cat. Corrupt Pink, Corrupt Hands, Corrupt Jedi, Corrupt CMO. This one's banger, low-key. I want this one. Uh, corrupt CFO and Corrupt Boo. Oh, there's more over here. Corrupt OFC, Corrupt CEO, and Corrupt BET, Corrupt Bet. So this one right here, if you have this one, this one right here, if you have this one right here, I'm willing to trade mine for it honestly if you have number six i'm digging number six a lot bro this one is dope as hell I, I actually want number six this one's dope too though there's a bunch of dope ones but number six is the one that really caught my attention at first i really like them so if you have number six contact me all right contact your boy all right with that said crypto Marxist, aka bone army letting you know that this is a probably the rarest nft collection all right only 50 og corrupt funds and they have, they promise you nothing, all right? So like, no utility, no nothing, all right? But they're busy. So I do like that. And I actually have a, proje a project in my head that I'm going to try to talk to them about. And if it's able to come true or come to, I will definitely let you guys know, all right? Because that's going to bring a lot of utility to this project. I'm extremely bullish on this project, like I said. You know, like th they're really active on in the chat. I've spoken with most with the devs, with the uh, the lead dev and 
one of the main marketers there. So honestly, extremely bullish. This is a chart, once again, it's called Corrupt Fund, Corrupt Fund. And this one, for some reason, on Dex Tools, it doesn't show, but I have actually seen that this has that Happy Face logo on it. And honestly, I just see this going to the moon. A lot of times we go in trying to find these hidden gems. And this one, in my opinion, is probably the best diamond I've been able to find when it comes to all these hidden gems. Because a lot of them don't have the team. They don't have, you know, that, that hipness. They don't got that swag. They don't got that I don't give a mentality. And this one definitely has a lot of those uh, prerequisites as well as a dope community, as well as a dope uh, lead team. Um, they're burning, so you know they're serious about their project for the most part because a lot of these projects, a couple of days, they're gone. This one's been active since March 14th. We're literally, the, the NFT is launching. It was scheduled to launch because it launched yesterday technically, but scheduled to launch one month after their launch, my people. All right, look, I'm going to stop hyping you guys up because if I do this thing, if I don't stop, this thing's going to keep going up. And you guys are going to miss a great entry point at under 60,000. You only need 1 million in order to hold it in your wallet to be able to mint that corrupty OG, which will grant you whitelist, will give you privileges. It is in the exclusive NFT token of this community. All right, cool. I'm going I'm to bounce on that one. But if you guys want more, you already know. Go ahead and hit that sub. Go ahead and hit that like. Leave a comment. If you're hype about C Fund, hashtag C Fund, all right, in the comments, as well as uh, bell it up because some of my stuff is time sensitive and urgent, like this. Literally, there's 20 or how many are, are left? I forgot. Let me go ahead and hit you with, with the latest because I'm over here letting you guys know that 30, 27. 27 have been minted already, okay? 27 have been minted. So more than half the supply is already gone, my people. There's only 50 that are going to be available, all right? So with that said, let me go ahead and show, and let you guys get to minting, all right? So I'm out of here. Crypto Marches, aka Bone Army. If you got any value from this, quickly hit that sub. Quickly hit that like. Comment, see fun. And don't forget, I have in the description the link to the mint. So I'll just go ahead and... Put the website and the mint, all right? And then you guys do what you do from there. So if you want more after you mint that, go ahead and hit that right there. Check out the videos up there. And like I like to say, I'm Bone Army. You're Bone Army. We are the Bone Army. And I'm out, my people. Deuces.